Todd, though, is it important to get that test out of the way right before the tournament starts? I thought it was a good game for our team to play it. Um, it was heavy from the beginning. The Czechs have some size and they use their body uh, body as well as far as uh, closing off lanes and body position. And uh, they go to the net hard. So it was a real good game for our young group to experience. I didn't think we were um, as prepared for it as I thought we would be, at least in the first 10 or 15 minutes. But the game wore on, I think we started to, uh, to figure it out a little bit more. Uh, I'm glad that we had that that type of competition tonight. Do you see some pushback in the, especially maybe in the second and third periods from your guys? Yeah, we responded. We talked about things between the, the first and second, and I thought we got better as the night went on. We made a couple a couple critical mistakes in our end that, that ended up in our net, kind of vacating uh, a real dangerous area before we have the puck and it ends up in our net. But uh, our goaltender gave us a chance early uh, to stay in it. But our, our team did respond and, and uh, said we needed that. It's pretty rare to see Connor go three games without a point. I'm not, uh, personally, I'm not concerned. I've seen him play a lot, obviously. And, uh, I thought tonight was his best game. He was, uh, there was an intensity level that went up even more. Uh, he had a number of great chances, uh, set some guys up for, for opportunities. And us as a team, uh, whole, a whole, not just Connor, we have to bear down on some of those chances. Um, I don't want to say that things came easy offensively for us in the, in the first two games because that would be very disrespectful. But we did get a lot of puck clock in those games as well off the back of the goaltender's head, uh, deflections, tip-ins that are going off skates. Um, we didn't get that as much tonight, um, but maybe we'll save that for the tournament. Were you, uh, were you worried at all when you saw the hit late in the second period, pull up and McDavid goes down? Um, you know, anybody that gets hit like that, you're, you're concerned about it, not just because it's Connor, uh, but he's a strong, tough kid. He got up right away and, and responded and played again. Do you have a good feel for your team right now? I think it does turn it starts up and a better feel when you start. Uh, yeah, I think we're, we're getting to know each other a little bit. We, uh, we're we starting to figure out what, what makes players tick. We're figuring out some positioning. Um, special teams, we're still working on a, you know, everybody's going to run out of time is what's going to happen. So you got to pick your pick your poison, narrow in on uh, on certain parts of your game and try and get better in those areas. We have a couple practice days coming up. But I feel better actually now than I did leaving where we were in Montreal the last the last game. I feel better because we've experienced that uh, that grit type game. Matt, Murray seemed to really keep you guys in it early. Did he show you enough? Not just today, but through the last couple of games. Yeah, he's been. He's, he's going to be the guy for you. He's been really good. Um, you know, in fairness to the other goaltenders and, and our staff, uh, management and coaching staff, uh, I'm not prepared to to anoint him yet. We have to sit down and evaluate the game, but. Um, I think you had very good eyes when you, you saw him play extremely well. And, um, those are the that's the same thing that we saw. So um, odds are he's going to be our guy, but we have, we need to respect the process and the others involved. Looking ahead to the group that you're in, uh, it's obviously going to get even more difficult as you move on. But what have you noticed from maybe watching some of the, the games, uh, whether it's been the Finns or the Swedes or the Russians? Uh, well, I, I think that. In, in watching the games, obviously the U.S. And, the, and Canada had that really emotional game right off the bat. The other teams are finding their ways um, as we go. Uh, I think the games will be more structured and heavier as we as we get into the tournament. The Swedes, the, the Finns, they played together for quite a while. Um, I would say the Russians are going to be good. Uh, our whole pool is is going to be tough, um, and we know that. But uh, we'll be up for the challenge. And we'll throw everything we have at these teams. Try and make them sweat a little bit. Thank you, Tom. Thanks, guys. Good night.